Welcome back. Cheering on the Rebels and representing UNLV at the highest level. The Rebel Girls and Company winning their first national title back in 2013. Fast forward 10 years, the team bringing home its 10th title in program history. And a story you only see here on Channel 13, Kay McCabe sits down with a team to discuss its rich legacy. We have really high standards and expectations of these young people and while they're in it sometimes it's very challenging but they always rise to the occasion. The UNLV Rebel Girls and Company have a quiet Cinderella type story. It took a long time to build but um, I wouldn't have done it any other way. Coach Marcia DiCastroverde has been on the coaching staff since graduating in 2002 and says since the program's first national title in 2013 they haven't hit the brakes. Well, that's just a sneak peek on how the UNLV Rebel Girls and Company are carrying on their team legacy. They talk about the intense training and dedication it took in winning their 10th program title. It was back to representing UNLV and just what Vegas is all about. After finding out that we're first place, it was, it was a great feeling. Aaron Morantic, sophomore company member, says sacrifice is what it takes to earn the top spot. We're right here in this room for about 33 days straight just cranking out full outs, critiquing every small little thing. Making sacrifices most college students couldn't even imagine being without. Get rid of social media and just to get rid of all external distractions. Last year, the team also represented Team USA and you guessed it, brought back that title too. Dikasha Verde says it's the desire to level up each year and to fight against the odds that's pushed them to achieve success. We are one of the smaller schools that go there. You know, these schools were up against their SEC schools. They've got different budgets. They've got different amount of students to even select from. But winning isn't the biggest accomplishment for this team. Senior captain Cassidy Turlin says the camaraderie is most important. You get so close with your team. You have experiences that a lot of people don't get to have and make memories that are once in a lifetime. And as they look to turn the page to next season, Dukasha Verde hopes this team remembers how far they've come. We'd be very proud of like what we've done because we did it with a lot less and had to work a lot harder to get to this place.